So to make our French bread, we're going to need, I have here, two and a half cups of all-purpose flour, or 300 grams, and to that I'm going to add one tablespoon of sugar, here. You can add this one. And then one teaspoon of salt. And we're going to add one pack of dry yeast, which is one tablespoon or seven grams. We're gonna dry uh, our dry ingredients no. together. And we're gonna slowly start adding our um, warm water. I'm going to start adding slowly the warm water and just mix it in with my fingers, just like so. And then add the rest. And mix it in just like So as soon as your dough starts forming um, a sort of a ball, I'm going to transfer everything down here, just like so. So as you can see, this is very simple. Basically, it's flour and water, and uh, you just knead it until it's smooth and soft. Now, I'm just going to place it in um, basically where the bowl where I mixed it. Slightly. I put some oil on it so the dough doesn't I'm just going to let it double in size, which is going to take about an hour to an hour and a half. So as you can see, the dough has been rising, and it doubled in size. And so now I'm just going to remove it from the bowl, press it down to try to remove all the excess air inside. And I'm just going to divide it. I'm just gonna, going to divide it into two pieces. So I have divided my dough into two equally sized balls of dough and just with a rolling pin I'm just gonna, uh, you, if you, I'm going to make two baguettes but if you want you can make four smaller ones. It all depends on how um, big or small you want your baguettes to be. So I'm just trying to make a rectangle out of this. So if you've watched my uh, video on how to make um, hot dog buns, it's basically the same technique. So you start at the, the bottom and then you just start rolling the dough on itself. Just like so. Just softly. And then I'm going to pinch the dough together where it comes together and then just to make sure it's even same thickness everywhere I just go over it like this and just to make sure it's not thicker anywhere more than the other side <laughs> if you can't tell, I'm really being distracted. Okay. So, and make sure if you can see here the scar of uh, where the dough comes together, try to make that um, underneath your bread. So, here we're going to just. Um, it seems a bit thicker here in the middle. 
So I'm just gonna get a knife. A sharp I'm knife. just going to go over and make cuts into the dough. A little bit deep. There we go. And then I'm just gonna place it on my pen. So as you can see here, both of my baguettes, I'm just going to cover them with a dry, um, just chicken, kitchen towel, <laughs> not chicken, kitchen towel. And I'm just going to let them rest for about an hour until they double They have size. doubled in size. You want to turn on your oven to 400 degrees and uh, prepare an egg wash, which is one egg yolk with one tablespoon of water. And we're just gently going to brush over with the egg wash. Hey guys, so here is the finished product. As you can see, they turned out really, really good. They're super crunchy. I don't know if you can hear that. Um, yeah, so I hope you give this a try. As you can see, it's super easy. I mean, it's flour, water and yeast, basically. No tricks, nothing special. You don't need anything. Um, special to make them it's super easy to make and really worth the time and energy because they're really really good so i hope you enjoyed and i'll see you next time